got a headset that I want to install into this bike which has a tapered head tube. The head tube takes a standard 1 and 1 8 inch headset cup at the top and a 1.5 inch headset cup at the bottom. To install the headset I want to use my cyclist headset press. You can see that the headset press is going to work nicely for the top cup because it's got this adapter. For the bottom cup, unfortunately the headset press isn't going to work because the adapter is too small. You can see that it just passes straight through the headset cup. So what I'd like to do is make a new adapter on the mini lathe which will allow me to install the bottom headset cup using my cyclist headset press. So the first thing I'm going to do is a facing cut. I'm just going to mark off the shoulder now. So I've got about 56 mil to play with, so I want a shoulder of about 20 mil. I'm just going to mark that with a light cut. Now it's time to start hogging out material. Um, we're aiming for a 40mm diameter at the end of this, or thereabouts. So. Here we go. Uh, made some progress. Now down to 57 mil from 63. So I've taken six mil off the diameter. It's uh, quite slow going. We're now getting close to our 40 mil. about 40.1. I think that'll do for now. I'm now going to centre drill the end of the workpiece ready for drilling. Now I'm going to work up through drill bit sizes from 3mm all the way up to 15mm. Now up to 10 mil with a drill. I think what I'm going to do is drill it through as far as I can and then I'll have to flip the workpiece over and drill from the other side. Last drill bit, 16 millimeters I think it is, not 15. Nice and slow. Well, 
I've finished boring the holes through. Uh, it's kind of interesting. You can see when you're looking through this end that the hole's slightly bigger than through this end. Now, I use the same drill bit, but what I think happened is as I was drilling through this end, because the, the drill was going deeper into the workpiece, there was more movement in it and therefore we got a bigger hole. So, but it doesn't matter. It's, it'll be, it'll be fine for what I need it for. The next job is to trim this down a little bit. It's a bit too long at the moment. Unfortunately, I don't have a parting off tool. So I'm just going to face it down until this dimension is approximately uh, 30 millimeters. So So that's sitting at 31. So I've still got a mill to take off. I'm just going to embellish things a little bit now and put a chamfer on this front edge. So here's the finished product. Turned out pretty well, I think. I ended up taking this dimension here down to 25mm from 30mm and I also put a chamfer on all the corners just to make it a little bit nicer to handle. Pretty pleased with it in general. Let's have a shot at installing the headset. So you can see that goes nicely over the top. Let's have a look at that. Show you what it looks like. No gap or anything there. Top's looking good as well. Let's just make sure that we can get it out okay. Yeah, it's coming out no problem at the bottom there.